was a big issue. I have been leading on this issue for the last two months. Do not raise the debt ceiling. Uh, I think the, uh, the consensus by and large of the population in Iowa that they felt uh, simply do not raise the debt ceiling. We already pay, there's enough income, there's enough taxes and so forth to pay the uh, duty of government, make it work in, in the, in the, in the, with those parameters. It all started because too many people have been eating too much candy and now they got toothaches because of a lot of decays and they go to the dentist and they, they don't want it to hurt, but you got to got to have some hurt before you get to feel better. So the more the president goes on TV, the more the stock market goes down. Because if you look at what his statement was, he said the reason why we lost our credit rating is because all of the people who wanted us to get our house in order and stop spending money, like, oh, the Tea Party, the Republican Party, fiscal conservatives, he said that's the reason why they downgraded us. You had to take a hell of a lot of candy away from a hell of a lot of people. It even includes, if they say, you know, some of the subsidies that we receive, and we receive a, uh, a lot of ag subsidies and, and those sort of things. You know, even if uh, we get a proportional cut in, in that sense, you know, we can live with that. Now think of this logic. Think of this logic. They got their money last week, $2.4 trillion. So they got their money... And after the fact, two days, the market crashes like over 500 points. And then the next day, S&P, after they get their money, decides to, and after the debate is over, then they're going to downgrade the credit rating, what, to punish us because we were in a debate? I mean, this doesn't even make sense. And then today, it goes down another 634 points. It's funny on one hand, it's absolutely tragic. On another hand. You can't borrow yourself out of debt. I have not show me one example in world history of anybody that was able to borrow themselves out of debt. One example.